Hello guys and welcome back to Dead Island. What I've done is I've basically just skipped a bit of it. All I've been doing on the way back to this area is just killing zombies, that's all. You've missed, I've not done any quests or anything like that. So, I, oh, I now have two levels level ups. That's it. Which is good. Okay, I wanted to save it until I was actually on screen. So you know what skills I'm going to put into it. I'm probably just going to do these two. Yeah. Okay. No big. No, it's exciting. Well, at least you guys know. The main plot progress is already at 16%, so I can't see this being a, a massive game. Uh, depending on how many side quests to do. As I said, I am going to try and do most of them. Why did you come back? Listen, the road to Henderson is fucked, washed away. But I cleared out the marina, and if you help me find another way into town, I'll think about helping you. Deal? There's one brother who might be able to help you, but he's been gone for ages. We don't even know if he's still alive. Shame too, because he meant a lot to the people here. Saved a lot of souls. He's a missionary named Marcus Villa. He's not local, but he knows the island like the back of his hand. Anyway, when we ran out of food, he went to fetch some from a store not far from him. That whole area was overrun early on, though. Okay. So like I said, he could be dead. Oh, sorry guys, I was just looking at them claws. I was trying to figure out what they are. I like how it actually says the stats of the weapon that you're going to get. I never know what's that before. I think I can help. Go look for Marcus. He's the only one who knows another way to Henderson. Okay. Shouldn't be too far away then. From the look of it inside the... You're a fog, aren't you? Yeah. Just going to avoid you. As I said, like, I'm not, I don't want to do what I did in Dying Light and spend a lot of time into levelling up and that because if this is going to be a short game, it's going to feel like I've wasted a lot of time again. So I don't really want to do that. I want to try and get it done so you know the story. Even though you probably already know the story. Because all of these games I am obviously playing very late. But I want to get most of them done on my channel anyway, so I've got it. Right, one's on top for a sec. Quickly checking here before I do anything. I think that for most of them, I'm going to take them out with Molotovs. That is, if a fire actually takes effect, we're going to have to wait and see. All right. How many have I got actually? I'm a lot's team. Start quest. Can you switch characters? That's interesting. I'm going to have to take a look at that. Uh, yeah, what was it doing? Inventory. Also, I've got ten. Does it take effect? It still takes effect. Fantastic. That was brilliant.
Anything else on these guys? No? The goat sent you. Yes, of course they did. I knew they would believe me. My disciples did not share my faith, which is why they are now carrion. I tried to warn them, but would they listen? No, they would not. You, Marcus? Ah, see, si, the Marcus Villa is my name. Uh, and to whom do I owe my eternal gratitude? Name's Perna. I heard you know how to get to Henderson. Henderson? Yes, yes, of course I know the way. You just went and fought those things? What did they beat you? Weren't you afraid? They can't infect me, I'm immune. Remarkable. Truly remarkable. Are you the only one who is immune? What is this, 20 fucking questions? There are five of us. We're using Paradise as a base camp. Paradise, yes. I know what that is. You are truly a blessing from the goats. Amazing. I'm afraid I need to ask you for one more favor, however. Just one more. My flock will survive this, for they are blessed people. Man can do nothing to us. Now then, there is a place where we keep our provisions, but it is overrun with the infected. Bring them to me, okay. and I will tell you how to get to Henderson. Sure. Good. Bring me the good stuff. Go. It's gonna be alcohol or something, there. Go to the dead zone. No door or anything as a whole. Hang on. Yep. No mind. Tell so you what, actually, let me repair this before I go because I'm, I'm, I'm liking this. Let me sort my skill out. Melee weapon durability. Yeah, I think I'll do durability. Outside. Fuck. Okay, I'm gonna still gonna go for it. Fuck it. I didn't realize your health goes down. Stay up on the rock. Okay. Not to self, don't take the river again. I'd rather go around and risk losing health. Ah, you know what? You know what? It might have been quicker walking around actually because I'm still here, aren't I? Oh, for God's sake. I didn't go that far in. Fucking pushing me back. Maybe there's something we can use. So he is quite amazed at times. Oh, fuck off. to the left of you, not straight ahead. I don't know, I feel like Riptide is a lot more buggy than the original Dead Island. It feels like it might have been rushed. I still like the storyline so far, but I still think 
it's excellent for obviously finishing off the story. For like everyone who was wondering what happened next, kind of thing. I can't help but feel that we were more like, do you know what, let's do a Dead Island 2. But then halfway through doing it, we were like, this is taking too long, let's throw this in. But keep them going. Just randomly create more of them. I'm assuming they just randomly keep spawning. Well, not keep spawning, but after you've killed the first few, a few more just rise up. Oh, for God's sake. Why is his health barely going down? Ow. I feel like the fire spreads a lot more as well, which I don't like. Going, eh? If I come back, you bloody better kill me. That should be the last one. If not, I'll finish him off with this. He says, Oh, for fuck's sake. Was that six Molotovs that he used? They were mainly just on him. Fuck off. You want some more? Is that a morning start? I don't really know what that is. But let's just drop a random knife or knuckles. Hang on. No, you know what? I'll just keep them for sell. Nah, I don't need to do that. Alright, let's continue. I'm not too sure what this is going to offer, like in terms of the story. I'm wondering if we're going to find out what caused the outbreak, like altogether, or if it's literally just more about the survival. Or if it's just to actually see that it's not just Benoit that was affected. So what the fuck was that? Keep going. 
Oh, for God's sake. I need to take a breather. For your help. Come on in. I'm fucking in. Fuck. Ah! You calm down, mate. Anyone can sell stuff to you yeah, over here. And we have more quests. And the person to sell is up there. Okay, two on, less than 200. Is what I'm still going for at the minute. Gonna buy more med kits, should I? Yeah. Try and leave myself with a bit of money. village inland in the Jabba River and I don't even know how to describe what's happening here. In fact I probably shouldn't even be recording this but it's not the first time I've violated proper protocol. Some sort of plague has swept the town and people are panicking. Those infected seem to have lost their bloody minds. They become violent and aggressive and attack like rabid animals. They seem to feel no pain and nothing will put them down short of a bullet in the brain. The orders on high aren't making much sense, and some of the men under my command are beginning to freak out. Not that I can blame them. Two hours ago, we saw a young mother gnawing on her own bloody child. Jesus. They want us to keep everyone quarantined here and prevent their escape by any means necessary. When I asked them what that meant, they said, do we have to spell it out? Okay. I was just waiting for that recording to stop. I'm gonna accept all these quests and then go from there. I left some things in her life. Since you're a doctor, maybe you can provide me with some medical supplies. In the rush to escape, I left my notebook back at my clinic in her life. I used it to keep notes on how to create medicine from indigenous plants found here on the island. Once I have it, I can create medical kits. Get the book, and then collect the necessary okay. ingredients. I'll do what I can. The clinic is in her life. It might be hard getting inside, but you're clever. I know you'll figure something out. I want to double check to make sure some of these aren't... Oh. So obviously these are side quests. I forgot I accepted that quest, didn't I? The battery is still let's find a fence. No, I don't feel my back is killing me. Bring me painkillers, please. That sounds like a continuous event. You. I think I've already got some painkillers as well. Yeah. Oh, good. I am in a lot of pain. Bring me more. Yeah, so that's going to be a continuous Whatever event, isn't it? Kill the pain. Yeah, okay. My name's Maggie. And my group left a while ago. They went to find a place that was safer than this shack. They were headed to Henderson. Once they found a new place, they were supposed to send someone back for me, but I haven't heard anything from them. Hopefully nothing bad has happened to them, but I'm so worried. Can you please look for them? Definitely. You're a godsend. They were supposed to stop at a treehouse in the jungle. Okay. Perhaps you can start there. Last one? Please nope. You. I need medicine. I don't know what's wrong with me. I've tried everything, but nothing works. My stomach is killing me. Maybe it's food poisoning. Oh, there, there yeah, must get over be something. It. Will you help me? All right. 
there was a medical station not far from here. Everyone was killed when this started, but the medicine should still be there. Please okay, hurry. what we're gonna do, guys, is do all the side quests before we start with more of a story. Obviously, I'm pretty sure this guy in here is gonna do more of a story. Marcus Villa. So let's continue with the quests. What's my active quest? Antidote, go to the dead zone. I thought I'd gone to the dead zone. I thought that was your point of getting supplies. Right, okay, let's do electrifying first. Because that's going to end up taking me all the way back to the first community that we were with. Right, how do we get out? Yeah, I'm just going to leave this open for you. Oh, for God's sake. Are you serious? Why can't you just jump through that fucking gap? Just plug me controller in. Okay, from the look of the quests, I'd say it's probably going to be this. Uh, the rest of this episode... And one more before we do more of the story. Either one more, or we'll start the story at the end of the next one. Depending on how long it actually takes me to get these. Right, I need more stamina. I know that for a fact. Let's take a look, shall we? Map, make sure I'm going the right way. Which way am I meant to be going? Oh, just in that, that area in general, then. Okay, so it's this way. Catch it on. I know it'll probably be quicker taking the car, but considering I don't know the actual island, I, I feel safer on foot, to be honest. Just in case I get into any trouble. Telling me to grab fucking painkillers, I was gonna say. There we are. I was gonna say, oh, they have the painkillers. Look at this. Worst vacation ever. Found it. Result, otherwise, I'm gonna get in the way. This hasn't actually took me as long as I thought it would, considering it's just in there. I thought I'd have to actually search random cars uh, to find it. Yes. But I'm glad it's not worked out that way. Here it is. 
I'm still doing okay. that. Okay, I've got all yeah. I need. Let's go back. Is it this way? Yep, follow the pathway up. There we are. Went to the show for a bit, mate. Okay, follow this up and we should get there. You're infected, aren't you? Fuck. I need to rest. Hopefully, guys, we should have time for one more side quest as well. By the time I do this. Because I do want to try and get the story mission done. Or at least started. In the next video as well. I do want most of my videos to be story driven. Ah. Fuck off. I don't feel too worried about the med kits now. The fuck. Where's this? Oh, I thought we were going all the way back. Right, how the fuck? Oh, I meant get in. There was a door around here, but it wasn't saying I could get in it. Or do I need to be right up to it? No? Oh, I see. There's another one of these. Well, found it. One thing I'm wondering, guys, is I'm curious to see what the uh, big bad boss will be. I'm assuming there's going to be a big bad boss. Shit. I swung and then realised what it was. Fuck's sake. It has to be here. There we are. Don't yes. need a flare. That's everything. All right, how do we get out? Yeah. There we are. Okay, guys, you're gonna see a weird cut now, but I'm not gonna run 368 meters. So I'll see you in a sec. everyone and welcome back to Dead Island. Uh, I've got back to the um, Paradise Village but I forgot to click record before I started the conversation so I'm kind of midway through a sentence right now. Are those fences? This is for you. 
I think there's a there. way to improve our defenses. Those exploding walkers gave me an idea. I think I've figured out a way to make some mines. I can use his remains as an explosive material and build some new mines. Okay. Are you interested? I'll try. Get a couple of them to blow up and then collect their flesh. I also need some electronic scraps. Do you have everything? I just saw me these all. I've got, yeah. Don't want the knuckles. Uh, I don't want the flares. Sell flares. Should be a sell all option. Stuff like that, hang on by. Is there anything decent? Most of it's 300 or more. Okay, so should I get one of these? Required level 25. Ah. Could get that one. I'll buy that. Where's my inventory? There's no flare ammo. There we are. I don't see any point in the nail gun, to be honest. Wait to try it's kind of shit. Tell you what, fuck it, I'll sell the uh, flare gun as well. Uh, skill, durability. I feel like I want to do damage again. Tell you what, let's do. Let's do experience. Just to try and level up a bit quicker. What's my quest? Sorry if I went a bit quieter as well, though, guys. I, I realised I was sat back. I'm usually sitting forward when I do that. Okay, bring us some suicide emitting two pieces of electronic scrap. I'll do that later on. Because chances are, after I've done these side quests, I would have found some suiciders anyway oh 400 meters nah 400 meters again how far is a dead zone 600 meters safe haven fight oh my god okay so rescue mcgambi or whatever his name is let's just try and hurry and get here i don't want to shit Oh no, I'm on this is the same episode, isn't it? I recorded it like it was an another one, but this is going on to the next part of it. This episode is gonna be a bit longer than the rest. Because I'm not too sure how much I've actually just been recording. So yeah, we're gonna help this guy and then I'll cut I'll end the video. Most likely gone the wrong way. Okay, we've got to go up there. making good time actually I didn't realize how fast you could actually make up the distance found this place on the way back as well don't know why it gives me the creeps I think it's mainly the tune as well that goes with it when you enter the area it's weird Is there a specific way? Left or right? Uh, right. From 
looking at that. I don't like the fact I feel like I'm looking at the map a lot. Let's be fair, it's probably because I am. Because I've no idea where I'm going, and that's what I don't like. It's not very wide open. Like, for example, if you was using the original Dead Island in the city, for example, at least there was a lot of uh, alleyways you could actually go behind. Or go down and cut through. But with this, you can't exactly cut through a big rock. There's a few that you can climb. But not many. Where's my Molotovs? Let's get on here. Okay, this is gonna hurt. Why are your health, is your health not going down? There we to go find my family now no problem Thank mate you. you gave me two grand that was it I didn't say I want to use the ladder I'm trying to get in there we are okay guys I'm gonna leave this episode here I hope you've enjoyed this episode and the series so far if you did please click that like and subscribe button to show your support to the channel and I'll see you next time on Dead Island Riptide. Until then, good night and good luck.